Welcome to Touring China. Now I'm standing here beside the West Lake, the landmark scenery of Hangzhou. Millions of tourists flood into here every Chinese Golden Week. Why is it so hot? Do you know anything about the West Lake? The West Lake is the harmonious blend of natural beauty, historical fictions, and profound culture, which enjoys the name of world's cultural heritage. It's centered in Hangzhou, crawling by hills in three directions as a national park free to public. It may cost you six hours for circling around. Well, let's begin our one day in the West Lake. It's not the bad choice to boat on the lake, but not the best either. Next to me is a store where you can lease a bicycle cart. Yeah, firstly, you need a public bicycle. Here is the broken bridge. It's not broken, but about a heartbroken romance. It's Chinese version of Julia and Romeo, but their name were Xu Xian and Bai Niangzi. Broken Bridge, said to be the place where the story kicked off, now ranks fourth in the top ten scenery of the West Lake. In Song Dynasty, which ruled China from 970 to 1279, he is a famous poet as well as an excellent official, Su Shi. This road is named after him, which called Su Causeway. From the name, you can understand that it was Su Shi caused this way during his term while dredging the West Lake. Su Causeway, as well as Bai Di and Yang Gong Di, cuts the lake into three parts. Along the Su Causeway stand two tombs of a notable geisha Su Xiao Xiao and a brilliant martial warrior Wu Song in Song Dynasty. Fish viewing at Flower Pound sits here as one of the top ten West Lake scenery. The statue of Su Shi looks into distance at the entrance of his political works, with his memorial behind his back. It's been a long time without you, my food. Dun, 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 dun. It's time for lunch. Don't save yourself with only bread. Try some typical Hangbang cuisine like this restaurant. Hangzhou cuisine is salty oriented and somewhat sweet, which can be easily found around the West Lake. Hangzhou Restaurant, Grandma's Home, and Lo Wai Lo Restaurant are all famous for its Hangzhou cuisine. Touring goes on, filling now comes to the Nanshan Road. The first station is Leifeng Tower. As we mentioned before, the Broken Bridge was the place where Bai Niangzi and Xu Xian met each other. And the Leifeng Tower behind me was the place they were separated. It is said that Bai Niangzi was buried under this tower. Apart from the tower, Nanshan Road is famous as the Road of Romance. Luxury trees provide couples with dating paradise. So think about it if you are not sure where to take your wedding pictures. Another top 10 scenery, Orioles singing in the willows, is right on this road. In ancient times, it was treated as an imperial garden. Not far away located a prestigious art university, Chinese Academic of Art, whose campus has ripped worldwide awards. Shocking music, dazzling lights, and fickle water pillars. You must not miss the music fountain here. It begins to work at 10 a.m. every day, but night is the best time to enjoy this miracle. Last station, Hefang Street, an ancient market since Song Dynasty, still reverses traditional craftsmanship. After touring around West Lake, you can come here to visit how previous Chinese dealer sells, as well as take away something you are keen on. A tiring but nice day. There is a saying in China that couples walk around the West Lake hand in hand, will walk along all their lifespan. So come here with your partner. <laughs>